Okay, now we're able to do the first experiment, which will test the sign dependence uh, on Faraday's law. This is the, the minus sign, but we're going to test it by flipping the magnet over. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take the magnet, and I'm just going to do another trial, the same as I, I did before, and drop the magnet in. I'm going to hold it from the blue tape from the top. I will start Logger Pro, and then drop. And I have to wait for the five seconds to be done, or else I'll erase my data. There's my blip. I auto scale, and you can see there's my signal. It looks, it's the same run as last time, but I'll save this as, save as, trial zero one. just to have the first one. You can, I don't think you can see me saving it. And then I'm going to clear the data and zoom out. Let me auto scale, I guess, again, and I'm back to normal. And I'll take the magnet out again, and I'm going to hold it. This is, I don't have the blue tape, but I'm going to hold it very uh, uh, steady, and I'll measure it, and I'm going to run the magnet down, upside down. Hit collect. And, oh, that was not good. It, it bobbled. I'm not even going to keep that one. I'm going to clear the data. Clear all data. This is why the tape helps. I'm going to try to drop it just straight. I hit collect, and, well, I hope that's better. And we'll do an auto scale. Yeah, I think that's okay. We'll zoom in. Let me and and now you can see there's something significant about uh, the, this curve compared to the last run, and you're going to tell me about that in in your report. I will save this file as trial zero two. File save as. File 02, saved. 